Hi, so today I'll be going over the book Black Buck by Matteo uh, Oscar Opor. I might be butchering his last name, not really sure. But anyway, it's his first book. It's a very quick read, uh, around 200 something pages. Uh, I was surprised about how the pacing is so good uh, because you really don't dwell into the character psyche or anything like that. It's more just an exploration of startup culture and how it works. So full disclosure, I do kind of work in that culture, so I really could relate to this uh, book in a way. So um, it follows the protagonist, Darren. Darren lives in Brooklyn, New York. Um, he has uh, his mother, he has a girlfriend. Uh, and the thing he's trying to figure out is his life. You know, he's working in Starbucks. He graduated uh, from a very prestigious high school. He never went to college. And so people keep wondering why if he's so smart. So one day uh, there comes in someone into Starbucks who he kind of admires and he sells some uh, a latte that that guy didn't really want. And so from there, he's offered a job in this tech startup that he doesn't even know what it's about. Uh, so the tech startup ends up being um, kind of a mental health services uh, platform that is sold to companies who then use those kind of uh, benefits for their employees. Uh, so Darren's whole uh, shpick is that he is trying to sell that kind of service to companies uh, and making money out of that. He ends up becoming pretty rich, being successful, but in that success, he ends up kind of alienating his parents, uh, sorry, his mom, and then some friends. Um, and just, he kind of explores like what it means to be black and in the uh, tech startup culture. Um, it's a very interesting read. Uh, there's like mixes of racism in there that he explores, like he experiences microaggressions, etc. Um, so I definitely thought that uh, Matteo could have explored those a little bit more, but I understand he had like you know a limited number of pages he could kind of push on that subject matter. Um, but it's definitely worth uh, a good investment. I think the layout of the book was really good. I think the exploration of topics was very sufficient. Um, but anyway, he gets named Black Buck uh, by uh, other um, people in his company because uh, he reminds some of someone named Buck and he's black. So he's only one of the handful of black people in the company, which is pretty true. I think with any tech startup, there's limited number of people of color there and they experience daily microaggressions. Uh, by some people who really don't know how to, for some reason, talk to people of color, even though, you know, we're all the same people. You could just talk to us. We speak English. We speak other languages. We have other experiences. But when it comes to work, you know, you could just talk. But for some reason, some white people just don't know how to talk to people of color. I really don't know why. But anyway, I definitely recommend this book, Black Buck. Again, very good. Explore it. Get it at your library. Get it at Amazon. Get it at Barnes & Nobles. Wherever you get your local books from. All right. Till next time, bye.